Hey there guys, I hope you're all well. This is a bit of a different video today because I'm going to be pretty much just talking to you. Um, I'll be doing a little bit of playing but pretty much just talking to you so if you don't like the sound of my voice I'm, I'm really sorry. Um, this video starts with a story today. Basically a couple of years ago I bought a pedal. It's a Joyo Vintage Overdrive, um, basically a Tube Screamer clone. And I bought this pedal because I wanted this specific sound. Um, I wanted a bluesy sound, so I thought, okay, Tube Screamer. I couldn't afford a, an Ibanez Tube Screamer at the time. So I found this on Amazon, I think it was like 20 or 30 quid. So I picked it up. I got it, plugged it in, played a bit, and I was like, oh, this, this is, doesn't sound right. It's not, it's not really the sound that I'm looking for. So, so what did I do? I just I left it. I put it in my pedal board drawer. And then for the last couple of months, I've been thinking to myself, right, yeah, I really want to get a tube screamer. I really want that bluesy tone, that broken up sort of driven tube sound. So I was okay, searching online, definitely gonna get a tube screamer. Definitely gonna get either a TS9 or a TS808 or even the, the Ibanez um, Tube Screamer Mini that they've recently brought out. Yeah, definitely gonna get one of those. So it's gonna cost me around about a hundred pounds. And I was coming to terms with that, I was like, yeah, a hundred pounds, you know, that's that's pretty decent. And then I was looking in my pedal drawer one day and I found this at the back. Haven't used it for for years. Found it. So I was like, okay, I'll, I'll, give, I'll give it a go. And this time I plugged in my Strat to see what it was like. Again, into the Marshall, same, similar sort of settings to what I remember, um, but I was using, obviously, the single coil Strat. And the minute I plugged it in, I didn't even have to tweak any of the knobs. It... I think the drive was sort of at about nine o'clock, the tone was at about three o'clock, between two and three, and the volume was at 12. So those sort of settings. And that was the tone. That was the tone that I was looking for three or four years ago. Now, yeah, I was using, you know, a different guitar and maybe the amp settings were slightly different, but that was, this is the tone that I was searching for. So I was like, Jesus, I was literally just about to spend a hundred pounds on a on a guitar pedal that I thought I needed, but then I found this thing, and I dialed in some tones, and then had a little bit more of a play around with it, just turned the drive up, you know, broken up a bit more, and all of the tones out of this pedal that I was getting through my Strat were amazing. <laughs> like 20 or 30 quid. It's not an expensive pedal. I, so, I, yeah, I was just amazed at the actual tones that I was getting out of it. Um, so I suppose the, I won't say it's a moral of this story, my, my message from this story is before you, you go out and spend £100, £200, £1,000 on anything that you think will get you this sound, it doesn't have to be a pedal. It can be a new effect plug-in for your DAW or anything, you know. Before you spend that money, just search for the stuff that you've got. Look in your pedal drawer or look on your VST plug-in list. You know, play around with the stuff you have. Don't necessarily go out and buy the latest thing. Don't get this new pedal. Yeah, that's definitely going to give me the sound that I want. Have a look at your, at your existing gear because... The minute you pick up an old pedal, like I did, and start tweaking the knobs, you might find that the sound that you're looking for, you've already got, you just haven't found it in the gear that you have. I saved myself £100, literally £100, that I didn't have to spend on this extra pedal, that I don't actually need, because I've got a clone of a Tube Screamer, and it gives you the same or similar tones. So let me know in the comment section below if you've got a similar story to mine, Maybe you were looking for something new, 
maybe you had a sound in your head that you thought you wanted and you were going to buy something new to get that sound and did you find something that you already had that could do that sound? Thanks for watching guys, if you liked this video please subscribe because there will be more videos like it in the future and I'd love to see you there. Cheers, bye.